<laughs> All right, March 3rd, math for algebra. The sound effects will be going on the video. Alright, you solve for zero for each one. What do we do with the 12? We add 12 to both sides, so it'll be 3x equals 12. We have to get rid of the 3 in front of the x. So x is 4. That's one of our answers. And then the other one, we have x plus 4 equals 0. To get rid of the positive 4, we have to subtract 4 from both sides. So x is a negative 4. All right, our last one. We have to get rid of the negative 100. So we have to add 100 to both sides. We have where the square of x is, but we want this x. So we get the square root of that. The square root of 100, what's the square root of 100? I'm trying to scratch my head. It's 10. So our three answers are four, negative four, and ten. Let's try one more. Number two. All right, so we do the first one. To get rid of the minus 20, we add 20 to both sides. So I have two X equals 20. Our next step is divide everything by two. So we have X equals 10. All right, we have X squared minus 49 equals zero. So X squared, we have to add 49 to both sides. We want just x. This is squared. The opposite of squaring something is square root. So 7 times 7 is 49. All right, last one. To get rid of the positive 3, we have to add subtract 3 from both sides. All right, so our three answers are 10, 7, and negative 3. All right, so you guys do the rest. There's eight more questions left. Have fun.